Hello dear subscribers and viewers of my channel. Today we take a look at the Adler Diplomat. Enjoy watching everyone and be sure to watch the video to the end so as not to miss the most important thing. Adler Diplomat Adler Diplomat is a large car with a limousine sedan body and a cylinder engine designed at the Adler Frankfurt plant. It was introduced in March 1934 as a direct replay market, despite the fact that the Mercedes-Benz 290 W18, apparently, was the best-selling car with a cylinder engine in Germany. At that time, the total sales of which for the comparable period exceeded 8,000 units. The Adler Diplomat was discontinued in 1939, although records show that several cars were sold in 1939 and 1940, presumably for military use or for export. Cement for the Standard 6 model The Diplomat also replaced the Adler Standard 8 model, as production of the large Adler 8-cylinder car was discontinued in 1934 without a direct replacement. It was decided to abandon the name Standard because it did not carry any meaning, both in German and in English, which, in the opinion of the company, did not conform to the progress of automotive tech. Ology and the growing optimism of the era, resulting from economic growth in the German automotive market and in the economy as a whole, after retreating to the crash of 1929. Initially, in 1934, the diplomat adopted the bodywork from the previous Adler Standard 6 model. The Standard 6 itself received a completely new body in the last year of its production, which could only be distinguished from the old one by careful examination. The diplomat of the first year of release was equipped with updated aprons on the wings. The chassis that was the hallmark of the Standard 6 in 1933, it had a suspended structure, as a result of which the axles protruded directly above the main elements of the chassis. This made it possible to have a lower center of gravity and a more squat body. The axles W. Here installed directly under the chassis, making the previous Standard 6 obsolete in the early 1930s. The four-door steel body limousine sedan was manufactured by MV Bad, the country's largest specialized steel body manufacturer, from Spandau. Berlin. A longer wheelbase was also offered a 6 Pullman limousine, the body of which was probably also from MV Bud. An additional two cars with a convertible body were also offered. In 1935, the Diplomat received a new body, which now featured a convex more streamlined front grille and more beautiful wings over the wheels. The six-seat limousine still had a relatively vertical rear end, while other models had a much more streamlined rear end compared to the 1934 Diplomat. By 1938, the Diplomat with limousine and cabriolet bought. A work could also be purchased with Carmen bodywork from a snabberk which strongly resembled the style and character of MB Bud body cars. The 1935 facelift added longer overhangs, especially at the rear, which increased the car's length by 150 mm 5.9 inches. However, the wheelbase of 3200 mm 130 in and 3350 mm 132 in, respectively, for Foran 68 cars has not changed. The Diploma T engine was a 2916 cubic centimeters inline 6 engine with a maximum power output of 60 HP 44 kilowatts. Such figures also apply to the engine installed on the first version of the standard 6. However, the unit used in the Diplomat had a slightly higher compression ratio, and the maximum power was achieved at 3000 rpm, rather than at 3300 rpm. The gear ratios have also been slightly modified. As for the engine AR architecture, the Diplomat featured seven camshaft bearings instead of the four used in the standard six dot cars with the new 1935 bodywork retained the engines installed on the 1934 models. However, in 1937, the engine was significantly redesigned, it had a light metal cylinder head, the compression ratio did not increase much, and the claimed maximum power was up to 65 HP 48 kW.In 1934, the cheap EST of the Diplomat was introduced, a four-door limousine sedan cost 6,750 marks. 
the most affordable Mercedes-Benz 290 W18 with a limousine sedan body and comparable dimensions, in 1931 cost 7,950 marks. The difference in price between them indicated the competitiveness of the Adler Diplomat. Sales of 3,205 vehicles in four years. This indicates that the Adler Diplomat held its place in T. E.